The old JCPD building is our last refuge. When the lights go out, we will stand strong and fight back. A safe haven for everyone who deserves it. We will start again and leave the past behind. Come now, fellow outcasts. Together, we shall prevail. You want to buy some fat stuff? My drone... Does it look like I'm in trouble? Well, 
Yeah, probably does. Doesn't mean that I trust you, though, okay? You can't be too careful. Yeah, you touch it, you... Nixon is one of the oldest districts in Jericho. The whole city grew from that area. Nowadays, it's a hotbed for crime and violence. That's why our church is so important. We are Port Nixon's beacon. It's shining light. We bring hope and optimism. Or at least we did until little Johnny corrupted our holy cause. Who? Him? He's just one of my little brother's pushers. I caught him red-handed with a stash of drugs. I've been trying to make him come clean for hours, but he's been, well, shall we say, rather stubborn. He'll change his mind soon enough. Sinners always do. To be honest, we've benefited a lot from his supplies. But now that I know how he's earned his dirty money, I have no choice but to wash my hands of him. We've given him more than enough chances. May the spark guide you. That's mine. Give it back, like, right now. Seriously. Not cool. That's a memento from my ex. I mean, what would you say if I just marched into your workplace and stole everything that's not nailed down? This was a token of our love, you know? It's all I have left now? I'm a broken shell of a man. Whatever. See if I care. I mean, didn't want it back anyway. Didn't need it. Oh, it's that age-old story, really. Boy meets girl, girl dumps boy. Everything goes to hell. Said she needed to find herself. Now nobody can find her at all. I heard a little rumor she's hooked up with that rich bastard, little Johnny and Port Nixon. I mean, I'd go there right now to check it out, but I've got too many enemies in that part of town. Maybe you could, I don't know, snoop around a bit? Awesome! I was hoping I could coax you into it. Oh, crap. I said that out loud, didn't I? I just really need some help. I'm freaking losing it here. Yeah, like the old harbor? That's where the shady punk-ass little Johnny sells his so-called drugs. I just can't stand that gassy sleaze bag. I mean, have you heard those horror stories about the shit he gets up to in Terminal Z? Ew. Dude's like seriously depraved. All right, peace out.
I swear he... До свидания, товарищ. I swear... На здоровье. You found enough nano machines to keep my experiments going for weeks. If I just keep injecting people with little suckers, I will find cure in no time. Don't worry, I've not forgotten my end of deal. You can use med station free of charge, да? Word to wise, comrade. You won't get far with goody two shoes BS in Jericho. Great progress comes at great price. We can only beat Defrag if we beat Nanites with their own weapons, da? People pay big money for special treatment, and I take huge risk to help our community. Might as well cash in. Cannot fault you for taking advantage of your favorite doctor. You have business sense, if nothing else. Привет. Of course, товарищ. Huh. You're not... You're stronger than entire Russian... That's a pretty cynical way to see it, товарищ. You can't make an omelette without breaking some spines, да? All is good. Do not worry about me. True genius is never appreciated in its time. До свидания, товарищ. The Jericho City Resistance lives! If you want to join the good fight, we're closer than you think. Up there in the clouds. Who do you think you are, John Wayne? Famous!
You looking for the party? Go right ahead. Normally I'd have to frisk you, but what's the point anymore? People up there are too numb to worry at this point. They want to forget whatever's going on down here. You'll meet a lot of kooks up there asking you for favors. Bunch of needy pansies.
You should have taken the job at Seaside Court instead. off no matter how hammered I get. I'm not even sure. You know, nothing makes sense. You know, my company got this contract with AID a couple days ago, earned myself some big bucks. And all I had to do was find a bunch of sick kids and get them sent to AID command to have their defrag cured. It's just that, you know, I never heard back from any of them. And I just want to spend my cash and turn off my brain. <laughs> I gotta stop thinking about those really good kids. Oh wow, that's awesome. You're doing me a real solid. It's that old R&D facility right next to the evacuation camp. Just follow the smell of desperation and you'll find it. See ya. I know what you're about to ask, so how about I just go ahead and save us both some time, eh? Yes, I really am Kyle Baxter. The one, the only, the incomparable Iron Mouse. And no, despite my shredded torso, perfectly chiseled jawline, and brilliantly glistening teeth, I'm not really a superhero. I only played him in eight movies. Oh, and yes, I am still on the dating market. Pardon me? Of course you should know me. I'm Kyle Baxter. The Kyle Baxter. Don Hackett's Creo newsletter called me the last movie star. Are you trying to insult my artistic integrity? Because that's never worked. And don't try begging me for an autograph. I'm retired now. I never quit acting. Acting quit me. Those bastards at the studio replaced me with some smarmy AI dummy. Damn piece of scrap, never even joined the actors here. Now. They said it was because of my so-called drug problems and chronic paranoia. We both know they always had it in for me. Remember, tough as iron, quiet as a mouse. Yes, it's still... Both. Obviously. If you want to find out more about the amazing adventures of Iron Mouse, TM, go to the comic book store in Port Nixon. That's where I always wait for my fans. Uh, where my fans always wait for me. Remember, tough as iron, quiet as a mouse. new face. Haven't seen one of those in a while. We have some quite intriguing guests at this party. Too rich to worry, too poor to leave. Not me, though. I'll be long gone when the proverbial shit hits the fan. A man of my caliber requires the most exquisite piece of armor available. Sadly, my previous supplier was brought down by his lofty ambitions and the tip of a hunter's blade. Guess nobody else has the guts to go out there and do what needs to be done. Okay, 
but it's not gonna be easy. Um, I should have told you before asking for help, shouldn't I? Don't worry, you'll do just fine. You know those gorgeous robot statues they have at Gideon's Rock? Their armor is simply impeccable. 24 carats of pure protection. Of course, you'd have to strip them for every single part. Mint condition. I think that goes without saying. Hmm. Let's see. I still need a headpiece. And the chest piece? Yeah, nada. Ugh, you haven't even found a single leg piece. And both arm pieces are missing. Shame that. Well, no rest for the wicked. Is it getting breezy in here, or are you a breath of fresh air? Come back if you find more parts. That stuff's worth its weight in gold. Gideon's Rock is right behind the gate. There's a colossal, man-eating beast out there. And a lot of hunters playing war. Sounds like a recipe for disaster, if you ask me. Rebooting OS. Ah, good day to you. I'm Harold. You seem to have caught me with my firewalls down. How embarrassing. I am in charge of scouting capable warriors willing to hunt down a massive creature at the Artificial Wildlife Resort, Gideon's Rock. Please excuse the system malfunction. My network has been hacked. A mere human wouldn't come and... My master, Joan Gutenberg, has out of his mind with worry about Jericho City's night problem. He's been working 24-7 to find a way out. Whoever delivers the brain of the strange creature wreaking havoc at Gideon's Rock will be rewarded amply. I have already hired Miss Black and her jolly band of mercenaries over there. However, they have been ineffective so far, apart from stabbing each other in the back. I didn't expect you to be so greedy. Adjusting your profile parameters. Do not worry, friend. Your heroic deeds will not come unnoticed. After all, Master Gutenberg is one of Jericho City's most philanthropic misanthropes. Be warned, friend. If you don't succeed in your mission, the Nanites will be unstoppable in no time. Even I won't be able to fight back much longer. Luckily, my existence is of no importance. I'm just a soulless automaton, after all. Slay the fiend and deliver its brain to the Creo Institute of Technology. That's all I ask, friend. Good luck out there, friend. Initiating recovery
We need help. with the other hunters. You've left a trail of destruction down there. Guess you enjoy making enemies. My guys? Bullshit! Those jackasses betrayed us! It's every man for himself down there, cutting each other up like a bunch of spoiled pansies. We're the last hunters sane enough to catch that monster. Got the tech and the expertise. We just need some extra muscle. If you're willing to share the reward, we'll share the risk and guide you from our base. Perfect time to join this whole shit show, eh? All the glory and half the tech scrap. We can cash in on a massive bounty if we deliver the creature's brain to some mystery man at CIT. But remember, you try and get one over on us, we'll finish you. Does it now? You're welcome to browse for better deals if you feel like it. Just remember, this is the only game in town. Maybe you're exactly what we need. That beast has kicked our asses from here to eternity. Some old fart hired us to gut the sucker and scoop out its brain. Dunno why. I managed to find that freak's Achilles heel some time ago. Cost us a lot of good men. We can blast magnetic waves through the park if you activate the three old repeller towers scattered around Gideon's Rock. Ask my guys if you need more intel. Good luck out there. Finally, I managed to reconfigure the three repeller towers scattered around Gideon's Rock. 
It took a lot of work and, and a bit of guerrilla tech, but it seems to be working now. More or less. Old man Gutenberg came through after all. His tech drives that freak up the wall. Now we just need to corner it. If we survive that long. Howdy. I'm Roach. Hmm. Yeah. Pal of mine went AWOL, looking for audio recordings. All right. Go check the areas around all three repeller units. That's your best bet. Later. Machinery will result in automatic thoughts.
Kay, you'll be at the northern repeller soon. Just hang in there a little while longer. <laughs> It's exactly 8 p.m. and this is Jericho Action News. Six weeks ago, a terrifying nanite-based plague known as Defrag was discovered. AID have announced the release of a new experimental drug. A spokesperson proclaimed you can feel safe at home. What are you doing, just walking into my inner sanctum? I don't even know if I can trust you. Tell me the password or get lost. Well, what do you know? You passed the test. Looks like you've got good contacts. You might be just what the resistance needs. Our numbers are still low. There needs to be a groundswell. We have to send a signal. Tell people to mobilize. But we're not gonna do it over the airwaves. Can't trust modern tech. Not anymore. In that case, welcome to the Resistance. I see you already have a graffiti drone. Sweet! That should make things easier. Now all you gotta do is leave the new Resistance symbol all around Jericho. Defrag is a hoax. It's just swine flu. Let's see. What the hell, dude? You haven't put up a single tag? We'll never change the world if you don't get your ass in gear. Keep the struggle alive, friend. 
Party on! A massive gentrification initiative transformed Jericho City's former red light district into what's now known as Gideon Plaza. Explore hundreds of galleries with brightly lit windows, buy everything you'll ever need, and enjoy miles of malls to treat yourself. And if you remember this district from the good old days, why not buy your wife a gift? Evacuation this time without remorse. They've installed scanner gates everywhere. It's like we're nothing but lab rats now. This is the end game. And they always wanted a way to segregate us. Now they've finally got their wish. This is going to get worse. Much worse. Soon they'll kill us off one by one. It always starts like this. I can't wait any longer. There are still some secret escape routes. I have to get out of here. My own sweat and blood, Gov. Damn tunnels connect the entire city. And now? Now I'm not even allowed to sleep here for a couple of hours. No honor among thieves, eh? Not since you stole my credit implant. Take a hike.
Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank <laughs> you. 